Hey guys, this is Josh from Big Dog Bait and Tackle. Today I'm going to show you how to make a pop in that rig. Alright guys, so this is the gear that I'm using today. We have a swivel, three size one hooks, we have three floats, a snap swivel, and a pyramid weight. Now I'm going to show you guys how to put this all together. So we're going to put the line through your swivel, just do a regular fisherman's knot. So now we're going to pull down the line about 8 inches, bring them together, and make a T knot. So we're going to make a loop with the two lines, and we're going to come through this hole five times. And pull that down nice and tight so that your line looks like this. Now to finish the T-knot, what you do is you cross these two lines and you're going to loop them together five to six times. And you're going to grab your tag end and stick that through to where it looks like that coming out in between your two twists. And we're going to cinch this down to make your T-knot. And now I'm going to do this two more times on the line to finish up the rig. So I'm making these T-knots about 6 to 8 inches apart so that they're not super close and will get tangled when you're casting. So I'm going to finish up and make my third. Now that we have our three loops, we're going to finish this by cutting the line and tying on a snap swivel, just your regular fisherman's knot. Alright, All right, so now we're going to finish up by putting some floats on and the hooks and the weight. Now you can also use beads or some people don't like using anything and you just put a hook straight on. So we're going to pinch this line, stick it through the float. So looping the hook twice through the line is going to help it from falling off when casting. Um, some people have problem doing that, but keeps it tight on there. And now we're going to finish up by putting the weight on this snap. 
We just have a one ounce pyramid. If you're fishing off the beach, it's good in the sand. So we'll slide that through. And now we have your finished rig right there. All right, so there's a few different ways you can use this rig. Um, some people call it chicken rig. Some people call it the high-low rig. Um, this one is made mainly for pompano fishing and off of the beach. Um, there's different floats you can put on, colors. You can put beads. You don't have to put anything. You can just have your hook on there. Some people like to put a loop knot at the end of the line besides a snap swivel so that you can put bank weights or other weights on there easy um, for dropping off of a reef or something. But there's a lot of different ways you can make this rig work for where you're fishing and catch more fish that way. Thanks for watching that video. Please like and subscribe and if you have any questions add them in the comments or come to Big Dog Tackle and you can talk to one of the workers here and we'd love to help you. Thanks.